Along Florida's Gulf Coast, redfish are a prized quarry. We followed Stu Apt and guide Chris Klingle as they search the mangrove flats near Boca Grande for early season fish. Boy, that shoreline looks like you could be anywhere in the Everglades or in South Florida. Yeah. Those are big mangroves. Since the wind's blowing, probably just work these potholes in here. It's probably four or five feet of water. They've been holding quite a few fish and probably do some sight fishing up and down these things. What if I were to pop another one right back up in that shadow? Yeah, you can try it. It's amazing because some things can hide real good. Let's try this hole here. The white one out here? Yeah. Believe it that. Last second, huh? <laughs> Open his mouth? Yep, he sure did and said, uh uh. What I'd like to do maybe is take off this uh, piece of 20 pound trace, unless you think I may still hit a snook. There's always that chance of a snook, but because you never know, you see that 20 pounder sitting there and we get in to eat it and go, oh, oh man, yeah. we had a leader. Yep, I hear you. See how this smaller red and yellow does for us. It's gonna, I can work it slower because it's not gonna sink much. It's got a light hook in it. Yeah. It's got a little crystal flash in it. And this Palmer tie is gonna make her sink very slowly also, which I want it to just kind of breathe for the fish. What is that right there at a... What a I'm not real sure if it's a fish, you know, about, let's say, 1030. Am I pointing? Right on the very edge of that shadow and, and uh, you're almost pointing at it. It's right on the edge of the shadow and the light. Perfect. Went right over his head. Here comes one out. He's after. coming. Yeah, that one ate it. Ate that fly a little better. Ah, stay out of the mangroves, please. Hate the strip line. Get off the hook on the boat there. <laughs> He's got you. Oh boy. There you go. Mm. Oh boy. Mm, come on out of there. I thought he was going to get you. Yeah. He was about to get me, wasn't he? <laughs> yeah, he was real close. <laughs> Especially when my line got around <laughs> under the bow of the boat. Big difference that fly made. Yeah. Or just that individual fish. Who yeah, knows? You know, but I think know. it was that fly, too. If the next one does that. We'll know then. Of course, that happened to have been a pretty exceptional presentation. Yeah. <laughs> it really, really landed in there perfect for that fish. Can we stake out here and tie on? Yep. Got him here to you. Not a big one, but it's a redfish. Yeah. <laughs> and he ate that fly real he good. He sure did eat that fly. Hooked him about right, too. Yep, right okay. in the hard spot. Yeah, I appreciate that. Well, good job. Well, <laughs> like I say, ooh. <laughs> Not uh, good. Yeah. <laughs> just boy, laying in there a little bit longer. Just eased out of him, that's right. <laughs> just eased out of him. Well, I, mean, what do I don't think happen. you need to do anything for him. <laughs> Why, Chris, that was a good eye seeing that one way up in the shadow. Oh, thanks. I had a problem picking them out even after you pointed my rod on them. Here's a little tip that'll catch you a bunch of fish. It has to do with controlling the line with your left hand when you cast. So important when you cast to control that line with your left hand and let it shoot through the fingers of your left hand when it's going out rather than letting go of it, like I'm going to demonstrate right here. That way you're ready to fish. You can stop it anywhere in route. Even if you're casting all the line you have, it's important to do. Nice. On your line. Yeah, I rushed oh, that. There he is. Oh, yep. Nice fish. 
If you're not hooked now, you're not going to be hooked, sucker. My goodness. Nice fish. I mean, Two of them. If he wasn't hooked then, he wasn't going to be hooked. You know? Yeah, look at the one following him. I know. Come on back around and see me if you would. That's it. Now he just go. rolled over for me. Come here. Nice go. job. Nice fish. Okay, yeah. That's a good one. Real healthy. Yeah, yeah one spot. Some of them have more than one. I this know. This one it. only has two. Occasionally you'll find a redfish that doesn't have any. Yep, me sure do. Okay, let's good. put them back in, turn them loose, okay. get that fly out of them. Super. There you go, buddy. What a fatty. Hey, I really had a great day out here. I thank you. Thank Super you. Super red fishing. I hope you've enjoyed your day red fishing with us, and I hope you'll be back with us next time on the song.